Let me take the Uncle Mu ego away. Let me look at this team. This is a very good City team that are extremely frightening going forward. He's not expected to win the, 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 the game. He's, he's not expected to win the game. Relax, okay? Let me talk, okay? This is my channel. I can say what I want, okay? Last I checked, I'm half of, okay, this is half of football hot. Man City. Let me pull up the Premier League table. I think that these guys have scored 300 goals in their past three games. Just checking. It's, it's a juggernaut. It's a machine. It's high-level football. It's scary. How do you beat them? They're playing on a high level. Sterling, let's talk about it. It's AC World Class. This guy's playing some crazy, crazy football. David Silva, Guerrero, Kyle Walker, he's improved as well. You see, see what Fernandinho is doing because they're doing it Kevin De Bruyne. These guys, they're very good. They're, all, they're, they're, they're a good team. They're a good team. Okay? Is that, is, that, is that what you guys want to hear? They're a bloody good team. Let me just check something very quickly. Very quickly. Just relax, guys. Relax. Okay, you guys, you are you rush things way too much. You rush things way too much. Let a guy eat. Let a guy eat. Sit here at all. Tihad. 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 And Tihad. Doesn't mean anything because what, 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 what was the score in this same fixture at the Etihad? City are the favorites. City should should win. City have improved from what they were last season, especially in that game. It's a game that they definitely want to win because I think this game reminds them of what Mourinho and United did to them, denying them of a title celebration at their crib. Getting beat by the local rivals at the crypt to deny them title celebrations. That's a big win. Pep needs to be realistic. Don't tell me you're not Champions League favorite. I believe the favorites are Barcelona, followed by Man City, then Juventus. So United did beat Juventus, although they did suffer. I believe City are a better team than Juventus. And I think that if City played Juventus, my money would be on City over Juventus. Because this is a very good City team that are extremely frightening going forward. Let's talk, let's, let's talk about United. Um, has Marie turned over a new leaf? It started very ugly. I thought he was. I thought he was going to be, be, be sacked. I said, "Man, this guy's not lasting until Christmas." Max January. Max. That's what I said. Because me and Marie, we have a love hate relationship. I love the dude. He's he is one of my most favorite people in the world. I admire him, I idolize him, but I've still inducted him into in the Brick Academy and I've still called him an idiot and a fool as well. But even but the, you know, the people that you that they that you love, you should you should, you should tell them that, that you hate them, you should tell them that, that they are pricks because that's what it's about. That's what love is about. <laughs> has it has it turned over a new leaf? That is what I was trying to say because has Mourinho said, you know what? Let me take the Uncle Mu ego away. Let me look at this team. So maybe he has grown that instead of walking in with the Mourinho ego, human 2010 treble, Real Madrid 100 points and records, Chelsea title in my two stints. No, you're going to listen to me. Didn't really work. So maybe he said, okay. These are young boys. They really want to express themselves. 
They really want to play. They really want to be expansive. Okay. I'm still going to get them to be organized. I'm still going to get some discipline in there. But you know what? Let them express themselves. Let them be, be free. Let them move the ball around. Let them try and be much more into the ball and maybe not to be so rigid into the kind of roles that, that they play. And perhaps that is why you've seen United really being on pretty good, good form. Looking at both teams, man for man, City are better. Man for man, City are better. Um, City will have the best striker. They'll have the best attacking winger as well. Well, they'll have the most, the more, the more, the more effective attacking winger. They'll have the better midfielder. They'll have the better number. It's it's going to be very tough. So let's just, let's just, let's 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 go into detail. Let's let's talk tactics. With regards to Man City, what needs to be learned from last season? It's very, it's very simple. Play play ninety minutes. It's not over until 90 minutes goes through. That had to be one of the most frustrating losses that City ever had. They had it won. 45 minutes, boom. I remember watching the game at the UFF office. I was like, okay, this, this is done. And I was like, how the hell did they come back? Inspired by La, La Bill, obviously. But I do think on what Pep will definitely look for is this: these guys are weak defensively. And even more so, Pep looks at that game against Juventus and say, boys... Don't you dare waste your chances. Same thing happened in that, at the Etihad game last season as well. They wasted a lot of chances. I remember Sterling producing crazy chats. Because Pep knows that we will create chances. And that's what he's always telling them that, that we are going to create. Take your time. Be focused. Make the right footballing decision. And make sure that ball enters into the net. So he will know that early on we, we, start, we, we start heavy. We keep hold of the ball, but we move that ball quickly. Overlaps, one-twos, get into those pockets, make those difficult passes and try and break the line continuously again and again and again and again and again. Do not let, do not let them off. Do not let up whatsoever. But the key thing what Pep will say is that we are going to create chances guaranteed. We will have minimum three, four great chances. Do not come off that pitch and not take at least two of those great chances because I'm going to Smack you in the face. So that's that is the that's the mandate. City will dominate possession. They will dominate the game. They will force United to rush them and run. Simple. Take your chances. Take your chances. Simple as that. So with Mourinho and United, you will concede a lot of chances. Probably even more so than what you did against Juventus. Uh, you're going to uh, up against one of the best attacking teams in the world. So, I think Mourinho knows that this this is a this is this, this, this is a situation in which he needs his defense to work extremely hard. But I think what Mourinho knows that look the defense you got to work very hard. Make sure that Sterling doesn't have any space. Mark him tight. Make sure that those passes do not come into into space. Congest the spaces, force them out wide. No pass, do not, do not allow them to pass through you. But this is also a team effort. And I think Marine will say everybody has to work hard. Everybody has to work, work hard. Everybody has to run, 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 run and hustle these guys up. Match them at, in every single inch of the pitch because these dudes are freaking good, bro. They move the ball around bloody well. I mean, maybe apart from what Barcelona are doing, I don't think there's any other team that moves the ball around and uses the ball as well as this Man City side. Because that's what Beb called like he is a he is a genius at um, the passing game of finding the difficult pass and executing the difficult pass and finding spaces where you're like, where the hell did he find space? And that's what that's why Pep doesn't sleep. He's like he's obsessed with how do you Find those spaces that do not exist with the power of the pass. Not with the dribble, not being individual, no, no, no not being, being greedy, but passing the ball. Because you will always find space by passing the ball. The space is there. 
you just have to find it and you will find it by working on this training method. So United have to know that, got to be f fully aware. Because again, man, you give away too many open chances, it's lights out. Because City are up for this game. I believe City are more up for this game than United. It may sound crazy because it's a Manchester derby, but I do believe that City wants to win this game far more than United. Martial. You see, but before, before I get to Martial, I think for Mourinho, you've got to roll with... Um, I think you, you I think you've got to start to matter. But then um there's a point that someone made a United fan that if you start matter, can he can he work as hard and under the pressing game? Because this see that's that's the key thing. Can matter last 90 minutes? I'm not sure. He's, he's, he's getting quite old. He's a great thing to bring on. So maybe I do think that maybe you put him on the bench to begin with. And it's a, and it's a defensive thing. Herrera is in there as well. You work hard, physical, tactical fouls. Still in the game, or really you're just 1 0 down, or maybe even 2 0 down, so you're still so much in the game. You then bring in Matters to be like, all right, we now have an extra extra brains in the attacking area. So, um, prediction. Ah. Uh. Man, look, what am I doing? What am I saying now? Prediction, you know, can, 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 relax, just relax. I'll give you a prediction. Um, oh God. okay, look, look, these guys have scored a lot of goals. That's all, that's all, all I'm saying that they've, they are scoring a lot of goals. Three one to Man City. Three one to Man City. And why do I say this? Relax, relax. The, 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 the video is ended yet, so just relax. Just sit, 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 sit your ass down. The video is ended yet. Three one to Man City. I don't believe that City will waste their chances as Juventus did. I feel that City's attack will be too much for United to withhold. I don't. I still don't feel that like this United defense will be able to um, keep out City. That that much, so City will get get that as to a degree, um, and that's that. Um, but before I end this video by giving the victory to Man City three one, all I'm going to say is this: if by some miracle, Uncle Jose Olusegun Mourinho manages to beat this juggernaut. Could have put him above Fergie. Thanks for watching the video. Now think about becoming a football hot patron by pledging an amount each month and then gain access to exclusive content only on the football hot patron page. Peace. Thanks for watching the video. For even more analysis, head over to the official site at halfoffootballhot.com or just click over here.